Hello, hello, and welcome back to Inspirations, where you can find encouragement to inspire a life. This is Dana Susan Beasley of Angel Life Talk News, and I'm continuing my series called You Are a Blooming Original. Today I'm going to be reading from Joshua 4 8. Nevertheless, my brethren who went up with me made the heart of the people melt with fear, but I followed the Lord my God fully. Now this is Caleb speaking, and the thing with Caleb was, he stood out from among his fellows who spied out the land 40 years previous to this. Why and how? Because he wholly followed the Lord his God. The Lord promised this land full of giants to the Israelites. Caleb believed God and therefore was not scared. Forty-five years later, he was still not scared. Caleb asked Joshua to give him the land that the fearsome brothers Anakim ruled. He believed God would back him, and lo and behold, it happened. Kirjath Arba became Hebron. Caleb defeated the Anakim brothers who were giants. Caleb was faithful to fight this war for the promised land. Then at long last there was rest. What has God promised you? What are you believing him for? What great territories has he given you to conquer? Whatever it is, there are probably mountains and giants in the way, especially right now with the coronavirus and everything that's surrounding that. And those obstacles, those mountains, those giants could make your heart quake. Lots of hearts are quaking right now. But follow the Lord wholeheartedly, and this fear will not overcome you. Like Caleb, you will conquer the mountain or giant before you, and then you will rest. Let us pray. Well, first of all, what is your response? Because I always want to have an application to the word. How about this? Pray what your next step would be that God wants you to do and then be faithful and do it. So whatever that is, be faithful to do it. All right, let us pray. Lord, help us to follow you. Our Lord, our God, fully. Amen. Okay, so if you have found encouragement from this podcast, please like and share and follow. And also, write in the comments what it is your next step is that God is wanting you to do. If you have found this podcast helpful, please go to our website, angelarts.biz, where you will find tools, resources, products, and services that will help you in this journey. All right, so with that, I will leave you with my favorite blessing from Numbers. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face shine on you and be gracious to you. The Lord lift up his countenance on you and give you peace. This is Dana Susan Beasley of Angel Arts.biz. Together, may we reach new heights in our lives and beyond.